council resolution. And all 14 of us share one printer in Big City Hall. And so when I prepare a resolution, it's not just me preparing a resolution, but it's my colleagues as well. And when we have an organization and a leadership like we have today, it's always the entire council that confirms and unanimously approves that particular resolution. So Councilwoman Milton, would you stand very close to me? Where's my Councilman Mosby? Oh, he's close enough. Uh, <laughs> and colleagues, if you might, can I read this? Thank you. The, the City Council of Baltimore resolution, we are hereby known to all that the City Council of Baltimore offers its sincerest congratulations to the Baltimore City and DCP in recognition of your annual Freedom Fund banquet. The entire membership extends best wishes on this memorable occasion and directs this resolution be presented on the 7th day of December of November, I can't read, 2014 by our City Council President Bernard C. Jack Young, me, Councilman William P. Welch, Nick Mosby, and Sherry Middleton, and all the members of the Baltimore City Council. God bless and preserve this organization and thank you for all that you have done and will do. Madam President. And Madam President, it would not be fitting to present that resolution without honoring you and your leadership. And we prepared a similar resolution to Tessa Hill Austin Aston, President of the Baltimore City Branch of the NAACP, for your leadership in the NAACP for the Baltimore community at large. And our entire membership extends best wishes on this memorable occasion. And that directs this resolution to be presented on the 7th day of November 2014. Signed by our City Council President Bernard C. Jack Young, V. Councilman William P. Welch, Sharon Middleton, Nick Mosby, and all the members of the Baltimore City Council. And God bless and keep you in leadership and in prayer. Amen. Thank you.